Thanks for the help from my office. Why don't you go check on the others? Will do, Principal. Can you believe the finale has come this close, Penny? Not one bit. And I must say, it's exhilarating to be back here after finally getting rid of Null. I agree, and here we are preparing for the finale. We've cleaned up the mess and decorated the schoolhouse with balloons, confetti, and presents. I wonder who's going to win. Kira and Philip were like an unstoppable duo throughout the season. And done. We've spread the presents all over the schoolhouse. Reminds me of how I prepared a club festival with my club members. Yes, but man, I'm still freezing here. I should ask the principal or Baldy to adjust the temperature. You sure? I'm not freezing. It looks like Susan and Mary aren't freezing either. If you lived in a snowy, freezing mountain, you'll understand what I feel. Wow, I can't believe we managed to finish that poster banner that quick. Yes. Though this doesn't surpass my surrendering son Flora, this is for a show where kids who go to school compete. Wow, that looks cute you too. Thanks, Charlie gave us a little hand too until Brassy sassed him to set up more balloons. We just asked him to paint a text for the banner. I thanked him for that after he did so. Oh, finished already? Cool. Thanks again for helping me with the cupcakes, Kofu. My pleasure, Natsuki. So, since we still have plenty of time, would you care to help me with one thing? Um, okay. What is it? Follow me. Okay, so... Here's a question. Have you ever baked an actual cake? Well, no. I only baked cupcakes. That's okay. I can give you instructions. Baldi asked me to bake a cake that looks like this. Isn't that the cake that was in Baldi's Basics Birthday Bash? Yes, and he wants a cake like that for the finale. But won't we need to bake more than one cake? We may have a lot of students and gym leaders here. That's why we're going to enlarge it. And how will we do that? Easy. You just leave something like that to Monica. She made it easier for us to defeat Null, after all. Um, what is he up to? My dumb dad is doing the bird song again. Yeah, like I'm ever feeling the group from that nonsense. Say, didn't I hear that more parents are coming to help with the finale? Hey there, ladies. Bonjour, you're crash awake, we? Oui? That's right. Say, isn't that goth lady supposed to be with you, too? Darlene. Top boy needed to borrow her for a while, so she's back at stupid character elimination. Oh, gotcha. So, what are you two up to? Well, we're decorating the school, just like everyone else. Darlene was helping us until a giant top hat showed up and took her. Say, what is this stupid character elimination thing? And the top hat? It's a long story. Phew, that was kind of tiring. Yeah, even if there was a lot of people here. Hey, Kai, you. Hi, Leo. Dad. Dad, you're okay. Of course I'm okay. All that has ever happened to me was being sent to a dark dimension after losing my data and forced myself to tolerate the roughest last few days I've ever had. I was in fear that Null would have eaten you, but only until I heard you made it to the Doki school. Thank God you're safe Caillou. Dad, I'm fine. We all work together to defeat Null. Now everything's back to normal. Wah, Mom, you're back. Wah wah, you came back. Ah. Uh they're there i'm back and well the only thing that matters to me is that you're safe and you helped save us all i'm so proud of you i wish i was the one who got caught by no no leo i'd rather be me than you i'd do anything to keep you safe but now let it go null's gone now and it's thanks to you and all your friends she's right leo so no more crying okay and the finale is so close now turn that frown upside down for some reason, this reminds me of Alan. What try up to gumball? Mom, you're back. Of course I'm back. I've come to see my sweet son who's risen back up to defeat Nil after my capture. You all showed him. Yeah, serves him right for all the terrible things he has done, worse than Rob would do. Anyways, again, what are you up to? Helping to decorate the school. We're preparing for the finale. Lovely. 
Why don't I lend you a hand? Oink. So good to be back with you, Peppa. Oink. So good that everything's back to normal. So, Bobo, who do you think is going to win? I'm not sure. Kira has her smarts and Philip's got strength. Either of them could win. Marvin, what are your intentions with the can of green beans? What? They're good for you. You are high and delusional. I refuse to eat green beans for the finale. How much of an idiot are you? If you're trying to feed us all green beans, that is not funny one bit. What are you trying to accomplish? Then everyone will have some green. Johnny, can you do me a favor? Say no more. So, yeah, that's how we ended up back here so we would rush to grab the notebooks to make Null vulnerable. I'm impressed. And you've made more friends too. Um. Is it just me or do I see Johnny incinerating a can of green bins by using flamethrower from his rear end, making that weird man scream in horror? There's my brave little girl. Oh la mama. Yup. It was me. I was the one who formed a group to discuss the plans to stop now. It went fine until now regained his power. At least Monica was a huge help. Well Dora, what matters is that you did your best and I can't be any more proud of you. You were even brave enough to enter the school with him inside to grab the notebook. That's because it was team effort. All of us rose back up and defeated now. Ah, welcome back Tulip got eliminated again, I see. Yes, but that's not important. I learned that you all finally got rid of Null. Yes, it was an intense battle, but we all fought hard and that corrupted freak is gone for good. That's good to hear. So, anything I can do to help out for the finale? Anything helps. You can do whatever you need to do to help out. Works for me. Hey Baldy, there's something I need to show you. It's rather odd. Oh, okay. Lead the way. I was cleaning the mess Noel has made, until I saw these. Whoa, what are those things? They look like me. I did some research on them, and they came from your game. They're known as the bald loons. Bald loons? What are they? They're corrupted files, just like Null. But unlike him, these entities are harmless, and behave like balloons in Birthday Bash. Okay, and what do they really do if they're harmless? They serve no function other than to be counted. All the colors but the red ones. The red ones serve as light obstacles, and will surround the player as they grow in quantity until a distorted thank you message occurs. I see. And what do you plan on doing with them? I think I know an interesting challenge idea for the finale. Ah, I see. I'm listening. The next day. Ah, yes. This is the life. Oh, fully. Ah, Serene. Are you enjoying your stay in her island? Yes, sweet princess of the pure sirens. Your hospitality is much appreciated, Amiga. I'm happy to hear that. Say, you do look tired. Why don't I give you a massage? Well, I do feel dense. I'd like a massage per favor. Okay, I'll start with your legs. Um, that's too much pressure. Wake up, Philip. Wake up. Whoa, what happened to your voice? Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. Good morning, Philly. Sleepy head. Whoa, Kara. Hi. Um, what brings you here at a time like this? You didn't sneak in, did you? Oh, don't worry, Kiana. I mean, your mom. Let me in to surprise you. Um, that's fair. But, why? Come on, wouldn't it surprise a guy to wake up with a cute girl on top of your bed? Yes, but still, you surprised me. Mind giving me a minute to get dressed? Sure thing, Philly. I still can't believe we made it to the final two. What do you think, Philly? Hey, I was happy we made it, but yeah, I was surprised too. Ever since Charlie missed a match, it gave me the chills, hoping you would make it, and you did. I know, right? I had my chance. And I nailed it. Three matched with five by the way, 
but I was focused on 1 in 14. So, what do you think the final challenge is going to be? I think we'll find out once we head back to here school. I'm gonna miss Doki Doki Literature Club, but it's gonna feel good to go back to here school again. I agree, Baldi did tell us the final challenge is going to be birthday bash themed, so maybe it has to do something with a party. See, and everyone's getting it prepped at here school, by the way, because mama has to go to work, Bordeaux will be on her way to pick me, or us, up. Your mom told me that, so, I'll chill with you here until she arrives. Sounds good to me, I can't wait for the finale. Me too, I'm so excited. Wow, I can't believe the BCE finale is about to start very soon. I know right? I'm so excited. I wish both Kara and Philly the best of luck. Jacob, Paige, the you are. Yep. We're here for the finale. It'll be better than last stand, I can feel it. I'm so glad Kara made it to the final two with Philly. So, let's not waste any more time and head back to here school. Hello? Dar, back so soon. I was on my way back to here at school. Top boy dropped me off back here, so I'll be back at the failure condo after the finale. Say, what's it like working at the failure condo? Hey, it's something I do best as a babysitter. I treat everyone with tender loving care. It can be tiring after a long time, but I know I can keep handling it. Well, if you can't keep doing this by yourself, Maybe you can't have me and Bordeaux come the stupid character elimination and help you out. I'll think about it. Though, it may be up to Top Boy, so I'll ask him next time he visits the failure con- so. Hi, darling. You're just in time. I'm taking the finalists to hear school. Is that so? Then, let's all go there together. Hello! Welcome to the BCE finale. Tell us your name please. It's Candace. I came from Jacob's show and I'm a member from the Sina Saints. Yup, you're on the list. Thank you Candace. You may enter. We were wondering when you're gonna show up. The finale is about to start in a few minutes. Yes. So, is there anyone else we're still waiting on? Everyone else has entered the school, minus their parents, because they're busy with work. All we're waiting for now are the finalists and the babysitters. Baldy did tell us that we'll be having some guests here too, but didn't tell us who. Okay, sounds good. Go ahead and head in. We'll keep an eye out for the finalists and the babysitters. Welcome back to my show, and boy, does it feel good to be back at here school. Anyways, last time, we all did no style and collected all the notebooks and reached the exits. After all that, we battled Null by tossing objects at him until it was over. After one last confrontation, Null glitched intensely until he disappeared. That's right, Null has been defeated, and he is gone for good. Here school is back to normal and the world and our shows have been saved. Then, Charlie won the prize. And afterward, I had him and Kira do a knockout round by matching pairs correctly. In the end, it was Kira who won the knockout round, and she reached the final two with Philip, nudging Charlie off the game. And now, it is Kira versus Philip who will win Baldi's character elimination and $10,000. Find out right now as you are watching the finale of Baldi's character elimination. So, what do you think you'll do once you reach your finale? I'll tell you in private when we do. For now, I won't say a word about it. Keeping it as a surprise? Fair enough. Hello my old friends. It is I, Security Guard Unit 20. And I have returned. Oh my god, Security Guard Unit 20. You're back. And you look so different. That's right. Doing improved. My memory bank has been transferred to my new robotic body. It has a new design, better functions, glowing blue lights, and they even added this sweet system on my back. Call me, Neo Security Guard Unit 20. Well, Revan did tell me you would have a new body since your old one is far outdated and badly damaged by Null. Yep. 
I knew this was going to happen eventually, but it was sooner than expected and I had to sacrifice my old body to let you all escape from hell. Plus, since he destroyed me, I had no control over his corrupting power to use my body as his own minion. I do miss my old body, but I know I'll get used to this new one in no time. I see. Well, it's great to have you back. So, let's head to the cafeteria. Dakota, Audrey and Nikki are here. You two go on ahead, I've got some catching up to do with them. Sorry we're late, I just finished some edits for the clips I got from my stream. I was wondering why it was taking her so long, so I had to visit her place to see what was going on. Don't you two worry about it, both of you made it just in time. We're about to start. I just can't believe Kiana and Mizumi's kids have made it to the final two. Honestly, I don't care who wins. As expected from you, Odds. Normally, I don't like being near children, but they seem to be growing throughout the season and it's better than Null being around, if he was still around. Well, let's not stand here and get all of this over with. I've got plans later today before we spend our night together again. Right, on the armo. Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Baldi's character elimination finale. I am your host, Baldi, and standing between me is the grand host, Dakota, and our hero, Monica. Ciao everyone. It's good to see you all again, and it sure feels good to come back and run another elimination season after getting my motivation to do so. And here we are at the finale. Time sure does fly, doesn't it? Yes it does. And boy it feels different to take a job as a game show host. But I had a lot of fun. Sure we had some major issues, mainly because of Null. But we had a great time. And even after we had to evacuate from here school to Doki Doki Literature Club after Null's attack, we still kept the show running until then. And we all rose and stood up to Null, erasing him for good. And now, we're all back at your school for the finale. I'm so happy I can get to help you all and serve as a co-host. Now, before we introduce you to our finalists, let's have our guests introduce themselves. Hi, I'm Jacob, the host of Hiona's Elimination, back to square one. My girlfriend and I came all the way from the island not just to defeat Null, but for this finale as well. So, it's great that all of us are doing well after we had to deal with Null. Now here we are, seeing our eliminated contestants having a good time here after getting rid of Null. Hi, I'm Jacob's girlfriend, Paige. It's so great to be here and we're so excited to see who wins. Hiya, I'm Tiffany, Dakota's girlfriend. In this multiverse, at least, I was a supporter in the past seasons, and it's nice to help run the show after a long time. Hey, I'm Audrey. I was a contestant in the past two seasons in Jacob's Elimination Series. Maybe I'll win one eventually. At least I had a relationship with Huey. Hello, I'm Nikki. I was around in the past Elimination shows, so I suppose it's nice to be here for the finale. Nothing else to say. Hello, I'm Reb. This is my OC and partner, Night Fist. We joined the main character cast as their allies and protectors ever since Nell's first strike. We helped the contestants evacuate and kept an eye on the eliminated contestants until Nell striked again. And after Monica had a plan, we finally gave Nell the justice he deserved. Hello. I am Neo Security Guard Unit 20. Well, that's how I feel, but I truly am Security Guard Unit 20. Yes, I got a new body ever since Nell destroyed my old outdated one. He even used me as a minion, but I'm glad that plan did not succeed. And all of you were amazing, because you finally defeated Null and restored peace for this town. And now we can enjoy the finale in peace. Of course, it's great to have my club members here, since they all helped out with PC after we escaped from Null. And my baby Sitaro sees, Darlene, Bordeaux, and Yasmin. They took care of some of the eliminated contestants and protected them. And Johnny's sisters, Susan and Mary, for helping out with the data antidote to cure the victims who got corrupted by Null. And now, it's time. Say hello to our finalists, Kira and Philip. Hi everyone, Kira here. And right beside me is my best friend, Philly. Hi, I'm Philip. Kira, 
Philip, tell us all how you two feel about reaching to the final two. Well, I was stoked to be team leader and I had to choose Philly to be on my team. Until the merge, I felt like we were the best team. And after the merge, we're still a glorious duo. We formed an alliance when the merge started, and we performed so well throughout the rest of the season. Here managed to win two immunities, and I won a ticket to the final two. Not to mention how well we did to grab that notebook and escape from now thanks to our team effort. So, thank you Bobby, Caillou, Leo, and V. You all are the best. And thank you to everyone else. If it wasn't for Null, we wouldn't be in an event like this. And I gotta say, I'm happy Kira made it to the final two with me. It's like we are the main stars of this show. Thank you Kira and Philip. Now, before we start the final challenge, we got two more guests showing up. Right, about, we are here. There they are. It's Kira's dad, and my artistic friend, Farm D. And beside him is Philip's mom, Kiana. Daddy. Ah, yes. Yeah. We've come to see your babies compete in the finale and win. And we can't be any more proud of you two for making it to the finale together. Farm D, Kiana. Thank you two for coming here and cheering for our finalists. Well, Baldy, I think that's everyone. Shall we introduce the final challenge? Let's do this. Kira, filler, right this way. What did I miss? Oh, there you are, Byron. The final challenge is about to start. All right, you two. It's time we explain the final challenge. Do you two want to guess? Maybe some silly all the way challenge? Or maybe defeating some bad guys? Ah, you're so close, Philip. Take a look behind you. Whoa, what are those things? They look just like you, Baldy. I'm just as surprised as you two are. Monica found them when we were prepping for the finale. They are called bald loons, and those entities are corrupted files. Corrupted files? Just like Null. Are they evil? Don't worry. They are not dangerous. But you two will be to them. That's right. The final challenge is called, Cleanse the Bald Loons. Okay, so we just attack the bald loons? And whoever destroys the most bald loons wins the $10,000. Something like that. However, when you destroy a bald loon, you earn points. And the rarity from left to right is from common to rare. The rarer the bald loon you destroy, the more points you earn. The purple bald loons are the most common, so they will only give you one point. The blue bald loons are less common than the purple ones, and will grant you three points if you destroy them. The green ones, which almost carry the same shirt as me, are uncommon and will give you six points. And the orange bald loons are the rarest ones. Destroy an orange bald loon, and you will earn yourself eight points. Wait, what about that bald loon? Yikes, it looks so freaky. Yeah, watch out for the red ones. Those are the ones you can't destroy, and must avoid. If you touch a red bald loon, you lose five points. Don't worry. I'll delete them once all the other bald loons are gone. And we'll gather up the results. Whoever has the most points wins Baldi's character elimination. Any questions? No Baldi, we got it. Well then, are you two ready? Ready. You heard him Monica. Let's start the challenge. I'm on it. Best of luck to the both of you. And best of luck to you, Philly. May the best finalist win. Right back at you, Kara. Here we go. All right. Shall we, Baldy? Yes, but what's with that other laptop on this desk? Oh, that's the laptop I found in an old building deep in the forest during the search for Jeffy. That's what No used as a prison for his victims, so don't touch that one. Oh, right. Let's leave that laptop alone then. Okay. I'm starting the challenge now. Let the bald loon cleansing begin. 3, 2, 1.
Uh-oh, the red bald loons are beginning to swarm. That means there are no more other bald loons remaining. I'll go end the challenge now. Huh? What just happened? Kira, thank goodness you're okay. Those red ball wounds are coming all over the place until it stopped all of a sudden. Yeah, that was weird. For a second, I thought I might lose more points. Me too. And I didn't see any more ball wounds around but the red ones. I guess this means the challenge is over. There you two are. I'm glad I managed to delete the rest of those pesky bald loons before they could freak everyone out. And that means the challenge is over. Now, please come with me. Baldi awaits us back at the cafeteria so we can gather up the results and find out who the winner is. Um, what was that noise? Maybe it was those red bald loons Monica is erasing. Well, okay then. By the way, why do you have that? Um, bored eating an apple on top of your head. I found this asset in the shop and it was free. So, I thought I'd try this out just to do something silly for the finale. Fair enough. Now let's hurry to the cafeteria. I'm ready to find out who the winner is so I can invite them to my finale in the future. Kira. Philip, you two have come this far. You two competed so hard not only in the final challenge, but the entire season. And now, here we are about to announce the winner. I gathered up the results after deleting those pesky red bald loons. So, Baldy, shall we reveal the final scores? Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, the time has come. The winner of Baldy's character elimination is... Five, four, three, two, one. Kira. Kira. Wait, I won? No way, I won the game. Yes, that's my best friend. She won the show for besting a tough guy like me. Philly, you were amazing. I hope you're not sad about losing. Hey. Being a runner-up isn't so bad. Besides, what matters is that we made it to the final two together. So I don't care which one of us wins. We had a great time, didn't we? Oh, we sure did. Yeah, that's my girl. My little winner. I'm so proud of you, Kira. Thanks, Daddy. Philip, you've done the best you can, and I'm so proud of you for making it to the final two. Mama, it's what Kira and I worked hard on. And we did it. That's all that matters to me. Congratulations to you, Kira. And for winning Bordy's character elimination, you've earned yourself an invitation to my high owner's elimination finale. Now, Kira, could you please come over here? Kira, before we bestow you the grand prize, there is one more thing I'd like you to do. Sure. What would you like me to do? See this cake behind you? Yes. We all would like you to blow out the candle. Okay, I can definitely do that. What an adorable idea. Go Kira. Wait. Hold on, something's not right. What's wrong V? My vampire senses are tingling. I'm hearing something strange in the schoolhouse. Is that so? What are you hearing? I'm hearing a pitchy static noise coming from one of the farther classrooms. I think it's near where Baldi and Monica were at. And I can hear it tampering with a laptop. Could it be typing something perhaps? Jacob, are you familiar of what V is describing? I think so. We know it's not null, so what could it be? Monica, weren't you in that classroom when you deleted the bald loons? Yes. I did see one in that classroom, and before I left, that thing was still there, so I thought it would be deleted by then. Did you see it after you deleted the bald loons? Yes. If you did delete all the bald loons before seeing that one bald loon in the classroom, how come it didn't get deleted? Uh oh. What in the world? Where is everybody? 
Hello, anyone still here?